Hello everyone, good afternoon, good afternoon, good afternoon and welcome to Fun Friday. Particularly silly Fun Friday today, particularly with our song, The Cat Came Back. I don't know if you're a cat person, if you are, some of this you might want to cover your ears for. If you're not a cat person, this is very much the song for you. And uh, speaking as a cat person, what I will say is this is one of the most fun songs uh, that we've taught here on the channel with an extra special up-to-date twist, which I'll fill you all in on very, very shortly. I've had uh, a really productive last couple of days. Loads going on in the world of home choir, choir of the earth, Nelsie Colts Orchestra, Yui Singers, all sorts. Uh, and I've also been dabbling once again, everyone, dabbling with AI, in particular GPT-4, which has made some substantial contributions, not just to Home Choir's programme today, but potentially to the future of the art form. Lots and lots to talk to you about, but in the meantime, let me check that everything is working here at this end. It's all very well having AI, but, you know, got to make sure that the, the HI, the human intelligence, is working. See, AI works on a whole load of really intensive graphics cards, and I tend to work primarily through uh, a direct injection of caffeine. Mmm. Suspended in water. With a little bit of milk. Just a spot. So I hope you're all having a good day today. Hope the weather's okay where you are here. I'm afraid in Bristol, well, it is grim and grisly. But you never know. The home choir effect is a well-known phenomenon. And with any luck, by the time this broadcast is over, there'll be bright sun coming in through this window. So much so that I have to close the curtain. So how is everyone doing today? Let's have a look. Lovely people there in the comments. Hello, everyone. Uh, fabulous. Right, lots and lots of people. I shall say hello to you in just a moment. I've just got a couple of buttons to press. We should have... Oh, Susanna. Lovely. We should have the breakfast song, which was a live recorded one I did back in 2021. When it's time for breakfast time, It's good. Like it could be louder, couldn't it, everyone? Toast and marmalade. Toast and marmalade. Getting a bit, uh, bit croony. Oh, where's the breakfast I like? Toast and marmalade. Deep fried. That would be Elvis's version. Wouldn't it? So, Tarara Bumdia is the other one. We haven't sung this one for ages. So we've got Tarara Bumdi, we've got an extra special programme today, including, as I say, The Cat Came Back, Erie Canal, and I've chucked an extra bit of Mersey Dotes in at the end, just because, because you deserve it, everyone. So that's that. I also have a super special track to play you all, which is another one of your submissions, everyone. You know, people have been very kindly sending themselves singing into me, little 30-second tracks. Well, I shall be sharing another one today. Dear Nicola and her partner in crime, Tommy the Cat, uh, sent me a beautiful bit of Grieg uh, from Pierre Gint. And so we'll be listening to that shortly. I've had other submissions from other people. Thank you to everyone who sent them in. Just allow me time to work through it. And if you'd like to send something in for us, well, you'd be very, very welcome to. Uh, so how's everyone doing in the comments? Very well, it seems. Uh, let me welcome you all in just a moment. I've just got to click a couple of buttons here. Good, good, good. So... Uh, let me pop out my participants list and welcome you all. And while I'm doing that, just welcome everyone who's watching this broadcast later on. We've done really well for subscribers recently. I think partly as a result of all the fantastic work that my wonderful team puts in to publicising and sharing all the information about Home Choir. What a fabulous team we have working behind the scenes. And also, of course, we're involved in so many wonderful projects, including Celebration Day, Zadok the Priest. We've got this concert coming up. So lots of people have signed up to join in with us recently. So if you are one of them, thank you for joining Home Choir. And uh, if you have come along, but you're not yet subscribed, as about 30% of the people who watch these broadcasts are not yet subscribed, why not wait today the day? Click that, that, that nasty red button. It should be somewhere down there. Yeah, if it's red and it says subscribe, no one wants to look at that. So click that button. It'll turn a soothing shade of grey. And it will put a great big smile on my face. So thank you, all of you. Hello to everyone who I know is watching live, but isn't in the live chat. A very, very good morning to Helene and Bill and Val in California. Hello, all of you. Hello to Sue and Tony and Sally and Annie and to Maureen and to Val. Hello to Hu Yen. Hello to Katie. Hello to Charlotte and Nikki and Anne and Linda and everyone else who I know is watching but is not chatting away. And then hello, everyone over here. It's rather an active chat today, very lively, which is what we want to see. And let me welcome you all by name 
And as always, these are the people who've been chatting the last few minutes. So a very good afternoon, Atty. Hello, Alison. Hello, Angela. Hello, Barbara. Hello, Carol. Hello, Carolyn. Hello, Christine. Hello, Colette. Hello, Diane. Hello, Dorothy. Hello, Elizabeth. Hello, Emma. Hello, Fiona. Hello, Gaynor. Hello, Glennis. Hello, Gina watching later. Hello, Irina. Hello, Jackie. Hello, Jane. Hello, Jill. Hello, Kathy. Hello, Kit Kat. Hello, Lisa. Hello, Lisa. Hello, Mags. Hello, Mary. Hello, Michael. Hello, Nesta. Hello, Nicola. Hello, Nikki. Hello, Patricia. Hello, Susanna. Hello, Terry. Hello, all of you. And to anyone else who might be here but isn't uh, in the chat, well, as I say, hello to all of you. We've been working immensely hard. Anna, ladies and gentlemen, has done the most incredible job of the videos for Sunday. It has taken two weeks of solid work to produce these videos. She is an absolute trooper. She's downstairs at the moment finalising the Jerusalem and Ave Verum Corpus videos for our concert on Sunday. And I'd just like to thank her. I know you would like to join me in thanking her for all of the work she's put in incredible effort in order to get all this put together it's looking and sounding fabulous so do don't forget sunday afternoon 3 p.m uk time if your phone goes ping with the emergency broadcast it's a it's a double alert not just to test whether your phone is capable of receiving that all important news in the event of some kind of calamity but also it's time for the home choir concert so when your phone goes off on sunday that's the time to jump on the stream and join us. But look, we've got lots to get on with today. We've got the cat. The cat is going to come back more times than you might think. So I think we should begin. And uh, we're, let's sing Home Choir in F major today. We're going to be doing lots of stuff in F and also in D minor, which is a very closely related key. So sing an F, an A or a C. Let's sing Home Choir and start the show. Here we go. Nice deep breath. And... Uh, <laughs> Beautiful singing, everyone. As always, thank you so much for that. And welcome, all of you, to a very special home choir. It is Fun Friday. And, of course, this time last week, I was in Ireland. I think at this point I was in Northern Ireland. Uh, and uh, Katie and I were having a little walk around Stormont, uh, the wonderful estate there. And, of course, the week before that, we were off the air. So it's been a while since we've had a Fun Friday. And it's just so great to see you all. Well done for making it to the end of another mad week in this mad world. Well, let's have a look at what we've got coming up today. Speaking of madness, we'll start in a minute with a fabulous folk song, something short and sweet to uh, get ourselves warmed up and get those toes tapping. Oh, Susanna. We'll then follow that with our new song today, which is called The Cat Came Back. Some of you might be familiar with it. If you haven't heard it before, after this broadcast, just put the name of the song into YouTube and watch one of the cartoon videos with more than a million views. There are several, and uh, you'll get the, the entire history of this piece. It's actually quite an old song. It's over 100 years old, and it is absolutely mad. More on that in a minute. We'll follow that with Erie Canal, a well-known song on this channel, and The Breakfast Song, which I've recently been teaching to a, a, a whole school of children just up the road from where I am. So uh, to any of them that are watching, this is for you. Then we'll sing Tara and we'll finish with Merzy Dotes. So a packed programme today and more treats besides. Let's have a look at what we've got coming up in the week ahead. Obviously, Sing Sunday is back this week with a live broadcast uh, and we'll be singing some music by Bach, by Handel and, of course, by John Ireland. That beautiful My Song is uh, Love Unknown, which we learnt just a couple of days ago. On Monday, we will learn the French-Canadian song Alouette. Alouette. Uh, oh, we're going to learn that on Monday and if you think what a lovely sweet little song just wait till you hear what the words mean then on Wednesday as promised we will learn some Scott Joplin we're going to learn Wrong Is Never Right which is an octet from Tremonisha his opera and then this time next week we shall be going as we learn The Lion Sleeps Tonight. We're going to have loads and loads of fun. Now, of course, in addition to all of that, we've got lots going on this week. We've got a live concert on the 23rd of April. Just two days' time, we'll be getting ready to stream that. That will be on Home Choir with a donation link to Alive Activities, who we're supporting. Please do donate if you can. Every penny will go to the charity. 1st of May, we're seeing Zadot the Priest in person if you can make it or watching a live stream uh, and that will be again 3 p.m on the 1st of may for the performance if you're going to come along and join us there are more instructions to follow and then of course celebration day coming up my goodness me so just to remind you again this sunday streaming between 3 and 5 p.m we will be joining with the city of bristol brass band and the university of the west of england singers in support of a live activities with what we're calling a st george's day concert remember when your phone goes ping it's time to sing now then 
then, Zadot the Priest, remember, if you are able to join us in person, please register at the email address here. More information can be found on the St George's website and, of course, in the newsletter. More on that in a second. And Celebration Day videos, please, 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 everyone watching, everyone watching, record us a Celebration Day video. We've had a few more, but we need loads. So we have extended the deadline from the 23rd of April to the 1st of May. If you would, please, please, for me, Please record us a video. You don't have to be singing out loud. The, the sound will be taken off it. You don't even need to wear headphones. Just record yourself along with the choral parts to Celebration Day and put them in the Dropbox that you'll find on the Celebration Day videos that we put out. And thank you in advance for all that. Now, uh, oops, that's the wrong slide. Well, of course, all of that information you can find in our newsletter. Go to the website, homequad.org, fill in the form, and you are done. And you'll get all of that information and more besides. And huge thanks again to Anna for the work she's put into that. Now, everyone, we're going to warm our voices up and we're going to start singing. But first, a special treat. Just as you take some nice deep breaths in and out and relax, I'd like to play you another one of your performances. And you know we've had a number of wonderful choristers send us in their singing recently, and I have added either my own my voice to it or to some instruments. And dear Nicola, and as I say, her partner in crime, Tomasu the Magnificent, has sent us a beautiful piece. This is Soldig sang from Pier Gint by Grieg, and I've added some instruments to support her voice, but I'm sure you'll agree it is beautiful. So as we relax our shoulders and roll our heads around, I'd just like to play you this beautiful submission from Nicola, and I've even managed to find a, a score that I can show on screen so you can have an idea of what she's singing. Here we go. <laughs> Isn't that gorgeous? What a beautiful, beautiful bit of singing. Thank you so much, Nicola, for sending that in. Well done. And now everyone, please, in the comments, can you just mob her with praise and thanks and love and big hugs because that is a lovely bit of singing. Beautifully done. And uh, as always, we're just so grateful to all of you. Those of you that want to send your singing in, please do. We promise to look after it and we promise to show it in the best possible light. I did record some vocals along with it, but I thought I need to shut up for once and let uh, one of our wonderful singers sing for us. So now then, you've rolled your shoulders round. You've warmed your neck and shoulders up. So let's do a little bit of singing. Well done, Nicola. You can take a deep breath and relax. <laughs> okay, so we're going to sing up and down. To an mm, and mm. such a lovely performance that really really was so i'm looking forward to as this builds we'll end up with a library of lovely performances by home choristers and then will come a glorious day where i can just sit here and you can sing and i can just sit here applauding all of you so so do consider sending us something at 30 seconds please that was a little bit longer than 30 seconds it was a minute and a half so please 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 keep it to 30 seconds uh because that that means i can get through more of them uh and then who knows? You could find yourself 
on Home Choir here on YouTube with lots and lots and lots of lovely friends praising you, singing your praises. So let us crack on with our performances today. We have... We have Oh Susanna to start. And uh, I know we've got Susanna here in the comments. And if your name is Susanna, well, you probably grew up listening to this song and kind of rolling your eyes every time someone sang it. I hope you don't mind that we sing this. Bearing in mind, I, I was born in the 1970s. And so I had all sorts of people singing Michael Jackson songs at me. Ben, the two of us need a look no more. So you see, I do completely appreciate where you're coming from. But I think the rest of us can all enjoy a rousing rendition of Oh Susanna. Here we go. They contain traces of banjo. Here we go. Well, I come from Alabama with a banjo on my knee. I'm bound for Louisiana, my true love for to see. It rained all night the day I left the weather, it was dry. The sun so hot I froze to death. Susanna, don't you cry. I said, oh, Susanna, now don't you cry for me. For I come from Alabama with a banjo on my knee. Duh. I had a dream the other night when everything was still. I dreamed I saw my and she was coming round the hill Now the buckwheat cake was in her mouth The tear was in her eye I said I come from Dixieland Susanna, don't you cry I said, oh, Susanna, now don't you cry for me For I come from Alabama with a banjo on my knee I said, oh, Susanna, now don't you cry for me Oh, there we do have fun here, don't we, everyone? As I say, apologies to anyone named Susanna. I hope you don't feel uh, too maligned by that. I think it's a great song. It's, it's a lovely name as well. So, folks, that is our first uh, full song today. Let's have a look at the new piece. Now, I need to warn you, OK? I, I, should, get, I should get a special warning sign at this point. And, a, and an awoo go. Woo, woo, woo. This is a massive earworm, OK? To the extent... But if I start, all I need to do is sing the first two notes of this and my son, my darling boy, who's nine, raises his hands if he's going to slap me. I mean, I honestly, so please do bear in mind, this is a, a really catchy piece. Don't say I didn't warn you. It is a very old song that's been around for over 100 years. And I do hope you enjoy learning it with me today. I'm going to sing you the first verse in the chorus and then we'll learn it. Here goes. Mr. Johnson had troubles of his own He had a yellow cat that wouldn't leave his home He tried and he tried to give the cat away He gave it to a traveller going far, far away But the cat came back the very next day The cat came back, we thought he was a gunner But the cat came back, just couldn't stay So that's basically it. It's the verse and chorus all over this descending pattern. Now, uh, let's learn the tune and the chorus. I need to give you a little bit of background then to the song, and then we'll sing it. So the first verse goes, Old Mr. Johnson had troubles of his own. In fact, you know what? I'm going to be a bit cheeky. I'm going to put this down a tone, make it even easier for us to sing. Old Mr. Johnson had troubles of his own. Everyone, old Mr. Johnson had Or next line, same tune. He tried and he tried to give the cat away. Everyone, he tried and he tried to give the cat away. He gave it to a traveler going far, far away. So it's basically the same thing four times. And then we go. But the cat came back the very next day. The cat came back. We thought he was a gardener. Now that 
that's a little bit of fun. The cat came back. We thought he was a gunner. So we go up chromatically and then drop down. But the cat came back. It just couldn't stay away, 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 away. Sing the chorus with me, everyone. But the cat came back. Now then, the thing about this song is, as I say, it's an old song, and if you look at the sheet music for this, and there are plenty of copies of it, and you look at the words, some of the verses, many of the verses, frankly, are products of their time in that they are really violent and really grim. The whole point of this is all sorts of things happen to this cat, and just calamity befalls anyone I I involved in it. And, and you've got whole train loads of people getting killed. You've got, you know, children drowning. And the last verse uh, drops an atom bomb on the world and nothing's left but the cat came back the very next day. Ha 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 ha. Not really the kind of light-hearted thing we want here on Home Quest. So, I've kept a couple of the verses here. And on the next slide, well, I asked GPT-4 this morning to write me some up-to-date verses using our contemporary world as inspiration. And it has done a magnificent job. It wrote these verses in 15 seconds flat, and they are absolutely fantastic. So we're going to sing this all the way through. You're not going to see these verses till I click onto the next slide. But bear in mind, artificial intelligence, when they say it's going to change the world, it already is. So here we go. This is The Cat Came Back. Don't say I didn't warn you. <laughs> Johnson had troubles of his own He had a yellow cat that wouldn't leave his home He tried and he tried to get the cat away He gave it to a traveller going far, far away and the cat came back the very next day The cat came back, he thought it was a gun But the cat came back, he just couldn't stay about the AI. He shipped the cat to Elon. I mean, talk about up to date. If you saw that rocket blowing up, there was a cat on it. But he came back. All's well. <laughs> As I say, if you're a cat lover, you might wince slightly at that. But 
then again, we all know that cats can be uh, can be our dearest friends. They can also be a little bit annoying. So I do hope you enjoyed that, and good luck getting that tune out of your head as we move on to our next song, which actually has a slightly familiar accompaniment. Let's sing Erie Canal, and this is, well, dedicated to all of you who are at the end of a work week, nearly, and it feels like you're just trudging along one foot in front of the other. Well, we all send our dear love to you and hope that the week ends swiftly and uh, productively, and the weekend is just around the corner. So let's sing Erie Canal, everyone. <laughs> I don't know where that cat came from. I thought we got rid of him in the last song, but pff, couldn't help it. There he was in the next song, but the cat came back the very next song. I hope you enjoyed that, ladies and gentlemen. As I say, dedicated to all of you out there who are working hard, earning a living, keeping the economy going. It's very nearly the weekend. Let us sing, everybody, the breakfast song. And as I say, I'm dedicating this one to all the children at the school just up the road from where I am. Because uh, I've started doing singing assemblies and choir with them on a Tuesday. Uh, it's such fun. What lovely, lovely little people they are. And they all sing with great enthusiasm and great gusto. We're planning a little concert for the headmaster. Uh, and so, yes, this one is for all the children at the school up the road. And all of you can sing extra loud. Now, if it's early in the morning, it's, well, you might not have had your breakfast yet. So see if this inspires you to pick something delicious for your brekkie. Here we go, everyone. <laughs> When it's time for breakfast, I like toast and marmalade, toast and marmalade, toast and marmalade. When it's time for breakfast, I like toast and marmalade. That's how I start my day. Just a cup of tea, toast and that's enough for me, that's enough for me. With milk and sugar, just a cup of tea, toast and that's enough for me, that's enough for me. I like cake and bacon and a slice of extra bread. If you have no bacon, then your sausage will do instead. Oh, when it's time for breakfast, I like 
Toast and marmalade, toast and marmalade, toast with milk and sugar. When it's time for breakfast, I like toast and marmalade. That's how I start my day. Just a cup of tea, that's enough for me. That's enough for me. With milk and sugar, just a cup of coffee. That's enough for me. That's enough for me. I like cake and cake and a slice of thick brown bread. If you have no bacon, then a sausage will do instead. But the cat came back the very next day. But the cat came back. We thought it was a cat, but the cat came back the very next day. He just couldn't stay away. Oh, I like egg and bacon. And a slice can't stay away. But the cat came back the very next day. breakfast as well there we go again I thought we got rid of him but he snuck in through an open window and made off with the sausages <gasps> oh that dratted cat well there we go everyone I do hope you enjoyed singing that and what a treat all these earworms to choose from with any luck they'll all merge into one fantastic smorgasbord of fun and let's move up, move on and sing our penultimate song of the week this is Tarara Boomdie and we'll have to keep an eye out for the cat I think we've managed to finally lock the doors uh, but if anyone sees the cat, please do let us know in the live comments and we'll see if Elon's around to, to send it up on the next rocket. But this one, well, it's a very, very well-known song. Uh, it's by Irving Berlin and it's called Tarara Boom Die. And whenever you sing boom, I want you to, to, to give it a bit of extra oomph. Tarara Boom Die, Tarara Boom Die. So jazz hands are essential for this one. It's actually written originally for people doing the can-can, but please... Don't do that, all right? I don't want anyone to hurt themselves uh, or to shock their neighbours, or indeed their cats. So here is Tarara Bumdi, everyone. A smart and stylish girl, you see, belle of good society, not too strict, but rather free, yet as right as right can be, never forward, Bold, not too hot, not too cold, but the very thing I'm told that in your arms you'd like to hold. Tarara boom die, 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 tarara boom die. I'm a timid flower of innocence. Pa says that I have no sense I'm one eternal big expense But men say that I'm just immense Ere my verses I conclude I'd like it known and understood The free as air, I'm never rude I'm not too bad, but not too good Tarara boom die 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 Tarara boom Everyone, I love all of the lyrics here. Rather than Tarara Boom Die, bend through the cat away. <laughs> Tarara Cat. What what cat? I think we got away with it. There's no sign of him. So I think we finally got shot of that pesky cat who kept coming back. And that leads us to just one more song. We'll finish tonight with Mersey Dotes and Dozy Dotes. A song I've told you many times before. I sang at primary school. I shall be teaching it to the kids up the road. Because as we all know, 
It doesn't have to be a song that was written in the last 10 minutes for it to be good. And if a song is good, well, everyone loves singing it. And I hope you've enjoyed singing along with us today. As with all of the best broadcasts, it seemed to have passed in a flash. And I hope I've loaded your mind up with some choice little tunes to just keep you company over the next few days before we see each other on Sunday for a very, very busy day. We've got to sing Sunday at 11 o'clock and then my family and I are going to dash across town to get to the theatre, set up for the concert and then I'll see you on Sunday afternoon as well. But join me please everyone in a bit of Mersey Dotes. escaping. I'm afraid, ladies and gentlemen, there is no scenario where the cat doesn't come back, including in our very last song. So I'm going to ask you to look out for that pesky cat. And if you can, try and put him out. I don't think it'll help, though. I'll see you on Sunday for our double bill of fun. Sing Sunday all together. And then the concert. Please do watch live. Please come in person if you can. It's the 1532 Theatre at Bristol Grammar School. We're starting at three o'clock, so get there early. Uh, tickets are available on the door. We're supporting a live activities. It's the City of Bristol Brass Band, who are magnificent. It's the UE Singers, who are fabulous. And, of course... We're going to be sharing with them some of our most wonderful videos, including Let Justice and Judgment. We're going to show them the Sanctus from the Foray Requiem with that really fiendish alto part. We're going to show them My Lag and Love and, of course, the premieres of Jerusalem and Ave Verum Corpus as a grand uh, a joint venture at the very, very end. But enjoy the rest of your day. Keep an eye out for that cat, and I'll see you soon. Lots of love. Bye-bye. <laughs>